Welcome to Snake to Fill Us! Grand finale today! Woohoo! And here we go! And I got. Can I get a boo boo on my finger again? Going to the doctor's office today because we are doctors. Ooh, let's go! Come on, come on! Let's go! Want to play? Want to play? Want to play? All right, everybody! Today's the grand finale! Woo! Oi, oi, oi! Get this out of the way for our new series that's coming. This is the reason why, guys, I've been going for these grand finales very quickly. There is a reason, because there's new content on the way with new gameplays. Believe me, you're like, you're probably like, why is she so hyper for this next new content thing? Well, because, sweethearts, I have something playing and it's been sitting and waiting too long. So, come in. Hi, Dr. Key. Have you seen Dr. Roberts anywhere? She... She's in Davis Hall giving a lecture on airborne pathologians. It's her favorite subject. I think she gets a kick out of scaring people. I know all too well. Okay, thanks, Dr. Key. No problem. So formal. I'll just go by name Taro. That's what I think. Dr. Roberts' lectures can go on for days. I need to find a way to get her attention without upsetting her. Maybe if I make a little noise. Haha! <laughs> really? A little noise? I have. Wait, how would we do that? Um, my question was, it would be how that make that noise? Oh, screw it! I'm not even try right now. I'll just find everything else first. Handicap sign. Where would that be? Nope, nope. I know these keys for lying around. We'll have to find them soon again. I know all too well. Broken pencil. Right there. Toothbrush. Where the hell would a toothbrush be? Ah! Hint. Thank you. I'm going to be pushing that little button quite often because I am getting impatient. And then again, today I'm very impatient. I'm not impatient. I'm just very hyper today. Sorry. I keep moving the computer, and you're like, you're like, Dancing Solace, calm down, man. Jeez, we know you're you're getting amped up for the next series. I can't help it though. It's just like I know what it is, and I'm getting a little bit anxious. And I know I got some other things that that is kind of behind, which would be like the angelic night and all that. Meaning like the um, what's it called? You know that I haven't got that done yet. You know. Because I haven't been able to get the chance to play it. No. How about that? Stop it! Now is not the time. Well, you want to get a walking cane. What the fuck is a walking cane? Sorry. That phone call drove me crazy. I forgot to put that on silent too. Usually when I do these gameplays, I put... Well, I'm already six minutes in the game, and I'm already talking about something in my real world again. <laughs> Funny. Um, I'm sitting there, and um, yeah, yep, exactly. Before I started playing this game, I was watching the Dory little video. I put it on uh, my discussion, you know, letting people know I'm sorry. I was supposed to start a little bit while ago, but I didn't because I got distracted, and I got, and I did, I got distracted once again by saying, "So cute, is it Dory?" She reminds me of me. The freaking lost memory that comes very quickly at times. I'm like, my. Because literally, I just watched that. Then I'm sitting there questioning myself, what the heck was I supposed to do again? I literally said that to myself. I'm like, now what am I supposed to do again? Oh, yeah, I record. I literally got that. Yeah, how am I supposed to see that? And given enough cardone shifts. Cardone shifts? Even the common cold could mutate into something far more. What's it? What's that noise? Hold on, hold the questions until the end of the lecture, please. Dr. Roberts. Ah, Stefan again. Well, I'm pleased you have decided to attend this isn't 
exactly an appropriate time to chat. Actually, I have some important news. Folks, excuse me a, mo a moment. Duty calls. Make it quick. Sarah unconscious rash symptomatic. Not that quick. <laughs> <laughs> well, she said quick. She didn't say exactly how quick, and that was the fastest way, and it cut time out. <laughs> Thank you, Stephen. You're smart ass just like me. I can be a smart ass like that sometimes. I was just down in an emergency. Seems our favorite paro child principal was brought in this morning with a rash that's spreading fast. A rash? Come on, Stefan! This, this thing was the size of a quarter this morning, and now it's covering almost half her body. She's going into respiratory distress. There is no ordinary rash. This is not no ordinary rash. Is that so? Lucky for me, my doctors are no ordinary doctors. Well, us home as soon as I finish. I guess you won't be sticking around. I love to really forget it. If you want brownie points, you can do my laundry. Get up going. Wait in Sands Hospital, Chicago, Illinois. Urgent care alert. Patient name, race, and sex. Sarah Ingram, Caucasian female, age 37. Patient brought to the ER unconscious. Visual, unremarkable except for prominent but localized rash in three hours since her arrival. The rash has spread to cover over 50% of her by some respiratory distress. Oh boy, she don't look so well, does she? She looks like she's out of the norm. Sarah Ingram, huh? Yep. <laughs> of all the luck, do you think Monica put us on this case just to get us grief? Give us grief? Very possible. So what's the rundown? She's currently under sedation. She was in a lot of pain. The whole thing's a puzzler. On the surface, it isn't so bad, just a rash. If it's just a rash, that means that on the surface, it is bad. Right. Point being that the rash isn't what's keeping her here, no matter how fast it's spreading. It's a high fever and a respiratory issues. But the rash certainly has some interesting diagnosis implications. Let's recheck her vitals and get her into a ward. Sounds fine to me. Everything sounds normal. I just said that five seconds, you little pain in the butt of mine. Uh, do we swab it? Can we swab it? I assume we swab and then put in like a thingy. Let's get that analyzed. And now we do a temperature. She's got a fever, isn't it? Strange, her temperature is back to normal, 98.6 on the dot. You know, I would have swore that she'd have a fever. Plant pot. Plant plant pot. What the fr Huh? What the hell? A plant plot. What the hell's a plant plot? What the hell's a plant plot? Am I even saying that right? Well, I'll never know because I can't even sit there and get an answer back. Because there's no one here to sit there and say what it is. Maybe in the discussion below. No, not discussion. The comments below, you can actually say something about it. Maybe you know how to say, I don't know, plant plot. So where the hell's a plant plot? Plant plot. I don't know where the hell it is. Where the hell's a plant plot? Oh, there's a plant plot. And a mask. Clapper. 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 Clapper board. Yep, that'd be it. Envelopes. Envelopes. Right there. Bread. Ten depressions. I just clocked it twice, you maverick! What the hell was that all about? I don't know. But there's that stupid ribbon again from the last time. Rope. Paintbrush. Um, I have it to clue. If you panic, you will not find it. I just did. Well, that's... Find the bottles. That should be... Sort of easy. Ah, uh, you are about to say it was easy, weren't you? Yes, I was actually gonna say it was easy. Ooh, I found the paintbrush. 
Yeah, see, that's the thing. You find everything but what you need to find at the moment up. That's the funny thing. And you find it. Now you have to find spoon. Go figure. It's odd that she no longer has a fever. Her blood oxygen is still low, so that's good. Why would it be low that good if her oxygen levels, her blood oxygen levels, gone? I don't understand. Never mind. I'm sorry. Did you say that's good? See, even I was questioning that. How the hell? Sorry if I'm screaming your ear off. Sorry already. How is that even freaking? Uh, like how? How? I do not get it. How? Oxygen level is supposed to be good, not or in a uh, breathe, breathe, breathe. Good respiratory breathing's good, but oxygen. I so don't. Get, I agree with this stuff, and I don't understand this. Well, relatively speaking, the hospital's really short on beds at the moment. If she doesn't manifest significant system cell discharge her, and I have a feeling this could be something serious. I might not want to play bridge with a woman, but I still care about her health. You want to run these labs? Sure. Yay! I love this part! And I'm not joking, this is my favorite part of all the game. The MRI I don't like so much. This I like, and knowing me, once I get to that MRI, I'll probably try a few minutes and then I'll skip it the next time if I fail it. Now I feel like I'm getting a rash. I must still have internal disease. <laughs> Let's go, Maverick. Oh, come on! It can't be that slow! Thank you. Come on! Hey, I just... Did you get that? Got you. Well, you're dead. I can't have you. Damn it! Not a good sign of that crap. Stop, you killed it. You... Are not being meany, beanie nanny woody booty. Bye, Bobo. You bye, bye, Bobo. I haven't. No, I lost my common sense at this rate. I've already lost it. Get me! No, you're not getting it. Okay, get 15 of these. Go look on me. When I got at least one. No, give me. Mine, mine, mine. You beloved, beloved. Give me, give me, beloved. Damn. It. You got a lot of blood cells are dead. That should be enough cells for a viral. Sir Ingram, my, my, oh, I used to know how to say this word. Micrococcus, negative. Stephylococcus, negative. Strepiococcus, negative. Enterococcus, negative. Curthra, negative. Brachialis, positive. Serum, crinine, normal. Comments. Edgar stroke temp 0.8898 degrees Fahrenheit. Infection is a big old negative. Maybe she could should be released after all. Monica is still lecturing. She was supposed to be done an hour ago. I'm sure she'll be here any minute. Highly doubt it when you guys all said that she freaking lectures forever on one thing. Nitwits. This time I just give up on her. That she would come to the meeting, you know. So at this point, I think she's gone. Like, literally. Pills. Like, pills as in pill bottle? No. Of course, we're not gonna make it easy on you. No, no, no. We don't make it easy. What the hell did I just do? Well, I wasn't expecting that. A fork. There's a shovel. Why the hell would it be? Oh, never mind. You know, I'm really starting to remember. Why I had s no, I don't remember nothing now. I just lost it. But I am starting to remember why I started. Nope, I lost my memory again. I keep losing it. I had it one second ago, and then it left the building. Crescent moon, art moon. No crescent rent. I, the whole time I was looking for a crescent moon and it was a crescent wrench. What the frick, man? Did I just stop that? I better not stop that damn thing. But I am sitting there doing a uh, thingy timer to see how long this takes. I said it was going to be about a minute. Or, one hour and 30 minutes. I'm hoping I get cut that down by half by getting through this quicker with finding things. But I'm not that great at finding things. Um, 
I think it is. Well, I'm, I don't know what to say about myself. All I know is I can't find a hole puncher or the shovel. A hole puncher and a shovel is not that easy to find. I mean, are they talking about a three-hole puncher, or are they talking about a two-hole puncher? Found it. And a shovel. But I haven't found the whistle, though. And I found that, like, five seconds. I did not! Nope, I did not want that, right off the bat. Frickin' Jubo! Crescent Moon. I wouldn't know to find one where I found one. Pens. Pens. I was gonna pens in the cup. Are we talking about one pen? Exactly what are we talking about? Found it. I decided I was just crushing the whole theory as we were talking about it. And I don't know where the hell. You know that those key situation? We're gonna have to go back in that stupid thingy because she's gonna lose her keys. Crossing. I was still looking for a moon. All right, team. What? What's the status? Everyone's favorite principal is resting comfortably in a private room for the time being. Sarah Ingram says is currently at Enigma. Stefan Ryan lives and on a, on a cottageous example. Cleaner than dandruff, I was exactly thinking lupus. It would explain her high oxen pain and rash. Ah, lupus. The wonderful catch-all. If you can't figure it out, must be lupus. Hey, I'm not picking it out of a hat here. She has the symptoms. Damn it, Stefan! I ran the test. I guarantee I would find that you have as many lupus symptoms as she does. It isn't lupus. The pathology of the rash doesn't match. And that's the most clinical def definitely symptom she has. Have you spoken to her? She was sedated. Didn't have a chance to. She's probably coming out of it now. Okay, then. Elizabeth Toucher. Find out more about what she was doing, who she was with, where she was, what she ate. Everything will do. Stefan, you head back to St. Olaf's. I'm sure you spent a lot of time in the principal's office as a boy. See if you can get back in there now. Nice. If I spend any more time here, I w want class credit. <laughs> Funny. Well, she. I would say he should get ca class credit if he did. I don't know. Whatever. I agree. He needs class credit. He needs class credit for it because he spent a lot of time here. Iguana, a sword, and not my now my own skin is itching. But then I've been itchy before this because my freaking is hotter than hell. And I have the AC down to 68 degrees. Doesn't matter what freaking happens in my house. I have to drop it very freaking cold sometimes. Just to get my own skin to sit there and be normal. Because my skin loves to give me a nice trouble. And you're probably wondering what I mean. Well, let's see. I'm allergic to butt bites. And if it gets too hot, my body decides to sit there and get itchy. Which means there's no way of stopping the itchy unless I get nice ice cubes. And keep them on. Problem is, I melt the ice cubes pretty fast. Because I'm just, my body's so hot. And before you have a smart ass remark on that, that, oh, she is hot. I, I swear to God, I'm gonna, if you say that in the comments below, I'm gonna freaking tickle you. That's what I'll do. I'll tickle you if you say it. I just, I just, I just sit there and think of smart ass remarks that you guys could probably end up saying. Cause I've had, I just, I just, I know for me if I was in the, the viewer prospect, me and you're, and you know, if I was in my, my family's position or any viewer that's watching me now, I'd be sitting in their thing, sitting and saying that just for the hell of it, just to get a rise, you know, a funny, ha ha, funny situation. Statue of Liberty. Where the hell would I find her? Or God, give me the ding, give me. Thank you. I'm gonna start using that button more often. I think that's what I'm screwing up on is I'm not using that button fast enough. And I have the, I think I'm, I'm very like pig headed cause it's like I wanna find it. And I just don't wanna, I don't, that it's a, like the word, the thing, that, that's the biggest thing about me. It's like, I was like that in school too. I'm like, if I, I would try to do something 
I know I saw that there somewhere. But no, in school I was like that. I would sit there be on a project and, and I'd be so like, like ah, you know, on a on a project or something. And my teacher's like, "Do you want help?" I'm like, "No, I don't want help. I want to do it my own." Boy, oh boy, they told me I was stubborn. But then again, I I admit I am pretty stubborn. If I don't want help, I don't want help I'll, unless I ask for it. For once, I'm not gr greeted by an, the un. Ub big you was oh wow I said it right I had it well I was thinking it's doing tiny words before I read the whole thing unambiguous Mrs Ingram feels a little strange feels a little strange God damn my wording is horrible ah oh, not this I don't like this one this is the one I had difficult with a long time ago oh boy do I not remember this one all too well ah oh, the belly of the beast yeah ah oh, the belly of the beast I'm not liking this one I did not like it before I did not I do not like it now do not because I, I, we're not at the part where I'm going to sit there filling the little thing there find the little oh man it's gonna be a nightmare when I get to that but then again if I keep thinking negative I'm gonna just get negative so maybe if I think opposite maybe it'll work you know okay I'll get positive I'll get through it you never know maybe that could work this time boxing gloves like one two fire extinguisher well that's supposed to be red hammer I've been trying to find the hammer ever since I walked in here Stop pressing buttons! Sorry. I'm yelling at my own self. Stop! I'm not pressing the buttons! I'm looking for the cane. It says cane. Oh, this says cone. Pine cone. Oh, well. Uh. That. Can't help it. I cannot help but push buttons. Sometimes when I push buttons I, by accident, I just find the stuff. I could have had that air pump before and I saw it. Oh, there it is. Okay. Race car. Nope. That is a screwdriver. Didn't you need one of those? No, you need a ham. Anytime I see something that is needed, it's not needed. Then, the next time when we come back here, then they need it. And it's like, what the hell, man? Letter P. Need more N cap. Encapsulated sunshine. Huh? What an addiction is encapsulated sunshine? An orange drink? Pink principal Ingram certainly is an odd duck. I don't even know what that means or what it says, to be honest. I don't understand it one word for it. So I'm right alongside of you on that one, bub. But wait a minute, I wish I could understand that myself, and I don't. Thumbs up? Are we looking like a thumbs up that you see quite often on like YouTube that deep? But I don't call it thumbs up. I call it kiss button. Kissy button. No, I don't call it kissy button. I call it love button. Oh, there's a letter P. Give me the P. Oh, thank you. As I say, I saw right there. You ain't gonna sit there and tell me no. Where is that hammer? Are we talking about that? The the knocker that you see in the guard courtroom. That's not, uh, the, you know, the knocker goes. Well, that's a gavel, I think. Yeah, that's a gavel, not a knocker. But isn't knocker and a gavel the same thing? Or is that different? I'm not positive. I do not like you, you freaking maverick! Yep, found you. See, I called you maverick, you found you. Gimme, give gimme! Give what the hell? Oh, there it is. You better show me, I put a bow, a bow. Mrs. Ingram? Yes, oh, it's you. You remember me. This is it for the best. Now I, I'll have an example to cite with explaining ironing to the students. Ha ha ha! That's what you get. Not really, but seriously. I assure you, mister, I only want to help you. How are you feeling? I'm fine. 
Do you have any allergies you know about, or are you currently taking any medication we should be aware of? No and no. It's a rash, nothing more. I don't see the point of prolonging this conversation. I've already been discharged. Discharged? What? On whose authority? I don't see how that, that's your business. It's more certainly... It is most certainly is my business. You, you're my patient. You are my, you are my patient. Screw it, I'm doing my way. And you need further evaluation. I'm not permanent in this. I'm worried about you, Sarah. Oh, I'm fine, Susan. Just be sure to use SPF 30. It's scorched. Don't let the claws fool you. You'll get burned. What? I'm a little teapot. Okay, that's it. Lay back, Sarah. You aren't going anywhere. I don't care if I have to report a false citizen. You need to stay here. Nonsense! I don't even have a fever! I'll fix that. Oh! I know what she's gonna do, too. Because watch what we're about to do. <laughs> oh, dear. A fever of 107.8. Technically, you should be dead. Granted. When, when it, with you, it's a little difficult to tell us. Surely we need to keep you at least another 24 hours. Yay! Haha, <laughs> ha, we got you staying for another day or so. <clears throat> Let's take your fever. Oh, I already have the number I need. <laughs> nice one. Nice. Okay, we need to find a football, preferably. Are we talking about football as in, like, England? You know I me, mean, overseas, where it's, like, actually soccer or something? I don't know. What the hell did I just do? Oh, red turtle. And a flute. Where the hell is a turtle at? Turtle. And a flute. Are we talking about what kind of flute? Okay, here we are. Safari hats. A wheel, a butterfly, a lizard. What the hell is it with always the lizards? Charlie, you don't need to be in here. Get out of here. Goodness gracious, where's it? The there's a pig in here too. What the? And there's a chicken in the closet. I, I assume we're in a football football field. No, we're not in a football field, but I think we're in a farm at this rate. Where's the pig at? Here, piggy piggy. What the hell did I just press? I don't know. Here, piggy 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 piggy. Where's that point? Piggy piggy piggy. Found you. Walking cane. Oh, god darn it. Yeah, and I know you're gonna be over there. I just had a feeling. So how am I doing on time? Not bad this time. I'm doing actually good. I've seen that trick a thousand times. Heck, my students sometimes even try it right in front of me. Your word against mine. I'm afraid I'm taking you down to the radiology if you were like that. You can't be too careful. <laughs> my, your life is in my hands, so you need to sit there. And I'm going to make sure you get better. You're just being a pain in the butt. Do you have, any cl Do you have anyone close to you? We should call anyone you'd like to at your side. Those questions have two... Distinctly different answers. <laughs> well, let's go. Oh, wow, I got that one right. Uh huh. Oh, God. <sighs> Frustrated. Bob got that right. I thought I was gonna get that wrong for sure. So did I. That just shows how much you have inside yourself. What? That just shows how much you have in I don't know, I can't think straight. That's the whole point. You can't think of anything right now. I'll be damned. I'll be damned too if you get this one. 
Are we already damned? Yeah. We've been damned for quite a while, actually. I'm pretty sure we're gonna be damned for quite longer, too, to be honest. Oh, I can't see where the hell that's going, and I was just guessing that. Holy crap. We got on the first chance. Does the board know you waste hospital money like this? You know what? She should have shut her trap. We're trying to make sure she's feeling better. She's being an ignorant pain in her butt, as always. When is Ed getting back? This week? I gotta tell you, Mon. Aw, oh, here we go again with a Mon! Can't she stop with a Mon part? God. I have nothing against it, but come on! You weren't saying that in the very first case. You were saying in the second case, but you didn't say it in the first case. He's been acting kind of drastic. Come on in. Co come in. Ah, Stephen Elizabeth, what's the word? Oh, I love... Well, didn't find much in her office, but I will say this. She has an unique up way of expressing herself. Almost nutty, you might say. I have to agree with Stephen. I think Sarah's exhibiting signs of psychosis. She loves into a non squatter Why question? Well, I was questioning her. To be fair, I find myself doing the same thing occasionally when speaking to you, Elizabeth. You aren't the most grippy, gripping conversationalist. Conversationalist! There, said it better. No offense. That's all I can say. Well, like, literally, I couldn't even get it out of my mouth. Conversationalist. See? Can't, I'm not joking. I really can't. It's making me upset. Conversationalist! Whatever, I give up now. I totally do know that. You know, I literally just. I'm not even bothering me trying that word. I said it. Whatever. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, it's hallelujah. 666. Nah, that's. Devil's Carnival's in my head. Devil's Carnival! Come on, come on. Oh god, my head's like all over. See, that's what I'm talking about, Dory situation. I said it says rubber stem, and I was looking for a rubber duck. Ah, funny. Where's the ore? Do we have to go again with that stupid ore again? God darn it all, I don't like you. It's either the microphone, it's either the dang ore, it's a dumb stupid cane. Not to mention, I can't even find a necktie. And I don't know if we're looking for one that's like this. Or we're looking for a, ha a hair tie or a necktie that's like this. Like a puffball. Po it's like a... What's the word? It's like a bow tie. It's a long way to explain. I can't explain it. I am so horrible at explaining things at times. Nail clip. And the nail clippers once again. Frickin' egg. All the frickin' love of the joy in the world. It has to be that nail clipper situation too. And the fake teeth again. God darn it all. What is it with them? Can't that person keep it in their mouth? No, they just let it go. And it goes out their mouth and they're running down. And then before you know, we have a cha cha going on. Ow. Why can't I just go? No, that's an alligator and a chop chop. Screw it. I don't even know. Necktie. See, don't, you're not giving me what I want. You're not giving me the necktie, and you're not giving me that stupid ore. Where the frick is that stupid ore? I will come, and I will come, and I'll come to bite you in the ass if I don't find it. I don't know what the heck I'm gonna bite though, because there's no one. <laughs> I'm frustrated. Oh, there's a tile. Uh, I see, I see, you feel sympathy for me now, game, huh? You feel sim- oh, well, about time, because you give me all those trifles. Yo, fur- You giving me a trifle. You guys even- Oh, there's a trifle, there's an oil. Arr, arr, arr. What's a lighter? Arr, arr, arr. Well, let's see, I haven't really slept for, since 2 o'clock this morning. Because I went to bed at- when you saw the, the thing release, no, it wasn't that night. Well, I went to sleep just before it was released, and when I was in the uploading process, and then I fell asleep. And then as soon as I woke up and I and I pushed it out for release, what you saw, 
I stood up, I was actually, I just got up a little bit before that, so I released it, and then after that, I stayed in for a little bit, and I went back to sleep, and then woke up at 2 o'clock, and then I was ready to go for the rest of the day. Didn't need that much sleep. My body knows that it needs to go, so. You know, it needs to go work, work, so. My body knows. It knows better. It knows better not to slack off. Goodness gracious. This is a case of the creepy crude you were telling me about earlier. Can I see her blood work? I have it right here. Well, what do you think? Lupus, right? Hmm. This could be ka 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 ta nas t cell It's often mistaken for lupus. Along with everything else, do you mind if I do a little looking into this? Not at all. She's stabilized and she's going in. She isn't going anywhere. I made sure for that. Great, thanks. Oh, and Stefan, I have a very important task for you. Oh, frickin' it. What are you gonna put Stefan there to? What are you up to, Meal? Let me tell you, Elizabeth, be careful of, of doing your job too well. If you heal every wound, zip, zip, people start to lose their sense of caution. They start to take chances because who is to worry when you have such an efficient safety net? Someone's throwing up in an ambulance again? What? Someone threw up in the ambulance again? I blame myself. I cleaned it up the last time, so when it happens again, the paramedics think, Oh, it's no big deal. I mean, we'll take care of it. I'm sorry, Emil. At least I'm learning hum humility. Why don't I give you a hand? Aww! What a sweetie. You're giving them a hand because the paramedics are giving too happy hoopy hoo. Whatever. I'm trying to get, I'm getting, I'm a little bit uncomfortable, I have to put, like, <coughs> whatever, crutchy. Preta, we, where is the crutches? Thank you. Skateboard, thank you. Toy blocks. Nope. Stomp. Toy box. Plunger. <whistles> Where's the plunger? Nope, not gonna find it in the school bus. And a turkey. Where the hell would we find a turkey? Oh, there's a turkey. And a plunger. And a hoot. And a hoot. And a hoot. And a hoot. I'm just clicking around on purpose now. Because I want to see if I can find something. Did level to my... I find it. But anyway, so my sleepy thing is going... <coughs> like that because, like, whatever. So if I start talking funny... Yeah. Uh, if you didn't watch one episode way back when, you'll... It was, uh, it was called Around the World. It was from my vlog. I'll leave a link to that one, definitely. You can see how when I get really sleepy, my accent changes. And it does happen. There's sometimes I could just be all the way awake up. And I could be around people and my family. Pretty sure if you've been watching all my videos, you know exactly what I'm talking about. That's what I'm saying. If people just walk in watching and see first one, I'm like, Well, hello there. Then they, you know. Maybe you guys will stick around and find out exactly what I've been talking about. <laughs> I think it'd be a good idea for people to stick around. They're always gonna get something in. Great, you know. For one thing, it's anything but normal. That's for seeing the channel. Mm, there we are. Yep, found it. I thought about this. What humbling experience awaits me next? Overflowing toilets? Leaking me bags? I'll be the model of humility in no time. Well then, how is this for an ego stroke? Wanna go get some dinner with me when you get off? Of course, too much humility can be also be a failing. Moderation is in all things. <laughs> is that a yes? Several sharp. Seven sharp. This is this is her important test. See if I left my keys in the lecture ha hall. Hell. See, what did I tell you about the keys? The keys were going to be the thing we were doing next. See, told you. And it's going to be what? Finding the keys. And I found them. Do, do. I'm not going to be that fast. It does eventually get slow, you know. God darn. This is the part it slows down. Oh, there you are. Key, please. Give me. Thank you. Looks like Monica wasn't the only one who forgot her keys. I tell you, medical school spent plenty of time and money teaching me how to deal with patients, but it never taught me a thing about dealing with doctors. Ah, that is funny though if you think about it. So we enforce a no shop talk rule. 
We can we can talk your shop if you like. I prefer to keep my appetite but not discuss in mine. Fair enough, my current patient is covered with a prolet prolence and possibly very contagious skin rash. I may have spoken too soon. That's okay, that's the part of Monica that thinks is supported, but I'm more interested in what seems to be some mild psychosis. Psychosis, now we are in arena I know much about. Are there episodes transit? Yes, very much so. Ah, well, then it's a self indicted indicted of what? Oh, of course, when the main course arrives, we shall continue the discussion after we eat. Sure. Okay, well. Okay, now I'm gonna say this right now. We always had that stupid bowling pin, too, to find. God dang it. Do I ever get a. Ooh, a pillow. Oh, my fluffies! My fluffies! Oh, yay! My fluffies! If you notice, every time I welcome a family member, and every time I welcome one, I always say fluffies down. And of course, I'll explain what fluffies are. Fluffies are pillows. I got nicknames for everything. If you're a family member, you already know that, that how what, what I'm like. You've watched all my videos, or maybe some of them. I don't know exactly how much you guys watch of mine, but I know you watch some. I know for one thing, though, from what I saw on my little analytics, more unsubscribed people watch me than my own subscribers. Oh. Family members. And if you wonder what the hell that was, that was me rewinding and erasing what was said. Don't ask. It's something I just recently did with a lollipop in the one episode. And now ever since I've been doing that. I don't have my lollipop. Damn it, I knew I forgot lollipops today in the store. And I was just there today. That's another reason why I didn't get to go work right off the bat. Where's my fluffies? I want my fluffies. I love my fluffies. I do love my fluffies. I love them so well. I flattened two of them. Now I gotta get, gotta get more pillows. <laughs> so that means pillow shopping. That is not no pillow. That was a freaking book. I know. See, this is a my old body pillow that's folded up. My other one's down there. It's fluffy. I try to keep my pillow. Even after they're kind of like sort of flat, I still try to keep them and use them for laying on. Until they're really super flat, then I just throw them out. But this one's still good to use a back pillow and lay up and, you know. So, I still got good use for it still. I always try to find use for things, even afterwards. I don't like to say goodbye that easily. Actually, I don't like to say the goodbye at all. I don't like the word either. I don't like it at all. I'd rather say see you later to a person than goodbye. Because goodbye to me means forever. So, I don't like that word. You were saying, well, if that's transit, it's either early on the pathology or linked to an injury vector. You mean she's on drugs? I did not say that. I simply listed the possible that spawned into my mind. Well, she's, she says she cleans and she's the principal of a highly respectable school in town, which means she would be more adamant about hiding it, even at the cost of her own health. I can't argue that. You know I was quite pleased you asked me to dinner. I was pleased you accepted it. It's nothing I do often. I know a janitor doesn't have the same date and cash as a doctor. Let me tell you, most of the doctors I know are a bunch of philodon- Oh, yay! Yay! Yay, 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 yay! 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 She's actually cussing finally! Thank God, I thought it was gonna be always me just cussing in the game and finally someone else besides- Thank you, Elizabeth, I love you! Mwah! You are such a babe. All right, let's go. Philanandra, Philandri, Fella Andron, whatever, jackasses with messy acid kennesies. I like that. You have to describe me to a T. What? 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 Watch now as I break this one small dinner roll and through my divine power, feed both people at the table. A miracle. I hope he's not a jackass. I wouldn't want a jackass. All right, everybody, statues report. Status report. I found two keys, your keys, as well as the keys of half of the hospital staff. Excellent job, Stefan. There's hope for you yet. Something we haven't thought about yet is a drug use. What if she's a dick addict? She has the motive to hide it, and it would explain the speed of progression. That would make the 
wood, this wood as an allergic reaction, not a liver or a kidney issue. Right. Yay, we're finding markers, right? No? Oh, fuck me sideways to Sunday. And I don't mean literally, but still. But Jesus Christ. Oh, I've been saying that quite often. A little bit too much lately. I've been wondering about myself what the hell happened to me. There is... Oh, wait, there's a cup there. My god, there's no cup there, though. Well, you're just a peachy peachy. What? I don't know, don't ask. Okay. And there's no knob there. No button there. And... I hate doing ding-dong with my freaking eyeballs. What do you mean ding-dong? I mean, like, looking right, left, right, left. That kind of gets a little bit abnormal. Crazy. You were trying to say a word, weren't you? Yes, I was, but I kind of get it out right. I figured as much. You really don't get much words out these days. Hey, that's not funny. Well, it's true. Well, I don't mean to. I'm trying my hardest to think. Just the words never come out right. I notice that. You just do that quite often. <sighs> when am I ever going to sit there and think rationally? We mean rationally. You're thinking rationally. I don't know what you're talking about, nor do I. I couldn't figure that ten seconds ago. I need a hint button. See, just like you didn't think that one. Figured as much. Stefan, since you're on a roll, why don't you handle this? Draw some more vials white while you're there trying to talk to Sarah. You might have more stuck with it than Elizabeth. I don't think she holds the same animus for you. I have a knack for rubbing people the right way. More likely, she simply isn't intimate. She's imitated by you. You're imminent and are of. I was gonna say benevolence, but it isn't much that you're. T you are good more that you lack the ability to do evil. Where well, I do become your whipping boy. A more accurate question would would be, what haven't you done to prevent it? Ah, <laughs> funny. It's true. He could say stuff. Hi, Miss Ingram. Do you remember me? Yes, you're with Dr. Font. Call me Sarah, please. When I Can I get out of here, Sarah? It's going to be a little while, I'll be honest with you. We had a bit of a cancer scare. Our chief oncologist, Dr. Key. <gasps> Dr. Tar Key? Yes, that's her name. I don't have cancer. Don't let her, her anyway near me. Why? Why? How do you know her? I don't know her. I know of her. Keep her away from me. Okay, okay. I didn't mean to upset you. Could you straighten your arm and make a fist? I need to draw some blood. More blood? Good lord! Are you selling it or something? Jeez. Oh, wait. I can't. Oh, yeah. I gotta. Let's put this to see if it reacts. Nothing. Okay, so it doesn't react. Fuck! Okay, now we're talking. No, we're not talking, because watch A do it. Die! Means it's A, B positive if I'm on proper... Pro, pro, yeah. Uh... Excuse-moi. Super play! I already did that. What is matter with you? I don't know exactly. I'm trying to figure that out. It's reacting. It's reacting to that. It's reacting to that. But it's not reacting to this. So it's negative. Or is it positive? Exactly. I don't know. I can't remember. I remembered it at one point, And I can't remember. It, if, um, type... Oh, type O, but it has neither the A or... Okay, whatever! Just give me the A and B compound. If the patient reacts to the AR, that means the... Bo so it's negative then! I had that. To me. What? <sighs> Super catalophagicus it's reacting to A. It's reacting to B. Okay, sweetheart? A and B. I'm going to have a... Hmm... going to have a hissy pit. Really. I I'm going to have a hissy pit. I'm going to have a BF. Which is a bitch fit. 
<laughs> like they say in uh, White Girls. Or no, White Chicks. I love that movie. Why did I see the other one? Man, God. Okay. Then, okay, so pussy smoke, blah, blah, blah. Then add A, B, or blah, 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 blah. The blood, since blood contains da, da, da. For example, if the blood reacts with the RH, that means it's positive, which it didn't. If there's no reaction, the patient blows an egg, okay. Once the blood sample is spread, okay. Patient just da, 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 Okay. Da, blah, blah, blah. Displace an antigen corresponding da, da, da. You must try three antigens before you can smell. Whoa, that makes sense, does it is? A B something. I forgot. Oops. If it doesn't react, it's snake. Okay, I guess that. Sir In Ingram. A B negative. Elevated. Low low. Normal. And slightly elevated. That wasn't so hard. No, it wasn't. Well, she technically was. And it drove me up the wall. Emil! Ah, oh, this is fancy meeting you here. I just wanted to thank you for last night. I had a great time, and you were quite the gentleman. Of course. Perhaps we should do it again sometime. That would be nice. So, this is your closet, huh? This is it. I'll give you two tour. Cleaning parks here, cleaning parks there. And you see the ho this hook? This is where I hang myself respect each morning. There's nothing undignified about what you do. There, we should all agree to differ. Telephone triangle. What the frick is a telephone triangle? Did I just sit there and... Oh, it's a telephone entrance. Oh my god! I'm putting words together now that shouldn't be put together. Oh, lovely. Yeah, did you know? Did you see the telepho telephone triangle? Yeah, I saw the other day. It was just so splendid. By how? Oh, I was looking for by how? Damn it! Oh, right there. Use the hint button. What's wrong with you? I'm sorry. I didn't know we were looking for a triangle. There's a triangle. There's a triangle. No, that's not a triangle. That's a freaking. There's a triangle. There's a triangle. Calm down with a button already. God. I'm trying to get this done with I want to get under 130 minutes. You're not going to get under 130 minutes. You should relax on the freaking timing situation. How about that? Okay, I'll relax. Sort of. Yeah, I had a feeling you were going to say that. As always, you always say one thing and you do another thing. Can you believe this? Dear Lord. Tomahawk. As in, Tomahawk. What the hell is a Tomahawk. Oh, I say, hey, the fire. You put the. Oh! Da! Tomahawk. Am I wrong? I don't know what the hell it means. However, my nose is itchy. There. And I stopped itching my nose. And a funnel. Where the hell's a funnel? Where the hell's a funnel? And go. Ah, I miss peepers. Go. Fishy. My worm. <gasps> oh, are you wearing your freaking feeties in bed? Am I wearing the right ones in bed? Yeah, I'm wearing my. I think I'm wearing my night nights in here. Yeah, I'm wearing my night socks in bed. I better be, because I'm not going to be happy if I'm not. I'll be upset, because I have my walking socks, I have my outdoor socks, and then I have my, well, my play socks, my walk-around socks, my night-night socks, which mean here, and then I have my socks that go outside into the real world, and they, and they have to be wore specifically that way. Or I won't, or you know, they can't go out. Or I'll, be, if they go outside, they can't contaminate it and it can't be worn inside. You know, if the, it's like my night night sucks, I can't do that. Because then I can't sleep in a bed. They make it, my whole bed dirty. So I have to transfer them. People are probably, you guys are probably think I'm weird, but that's just me. I have four different pairs of socks for four different things. I wear socks for different things, and they had to be specifically. 
I see your fashioning mag shift desk here. When uh, when I have a few moments to make myself, I close the door and do a little studying. I cannot practice menace, and so I have to stay on top of the game any way I can. You study in here? Sometimes. What if someone walks in and catches you? Ah, that is the beauty of it. I lock the door from the inside, turn out the light, and use a flashlight. Really? Maybe you could demonstrate. Of course. Zara, you didn't happen to attempt one of those dramatic gestures before you arrived here, did you? What's the difference does it make? If I did it, it didn't work. Dr. Fine told me that you said you aren't on any vacation. Was that true? I don't wish to discuss it. You know what, woman? That's what kills half the people in, in a freaking hospital is because they don't be honest with the doctor and then the doctor later finds it, traces it in their blood and then they think they're drug addicts and they, and technically sometimes they're not really drug addicts it it could be just other medications are taken I hate freaking people you gotta be honest with your doctors for a uh, found you found you I need a little carrying case and I need toothbrush which I can't find so I'm afraid I have to put you on suicide watch Sarah what I don't want to die. Well, then it shouldn't bother you in the slightest. Well, if you just be freaking honest with them. So I can be, make dramatic gestures her way and I'll make them mine. Now that I have a better idea of what I'm looking for, perhaps I'll make, have more luck this time than last time. I hate this. I don't like this. I'm bitching as I'm doing this. This is just lovely. But yeah, I'm doing a pretty well, good job what I'm doing. I think. Oh, that goes in the pin cushion in there. He opens the mailbox. Teddy! Perhaps this was the only way to finally get your attention. You can't play with people's affections and not ex accept there to be consequences. Flaws aren't enough. At least now Tara will never know. And you can continue living the lie of young blissful happily new woods, doctors. How Nazi picturesque. Please don't let it keep you up at night that you've prescribed this the medication yourself, Sarah. Oh, I think that I hope you never sleep again. Oh dude talk about bitchiness. God damn, I'm gonna have that difficulty again. This is going to come up difficulty. It's bitching. See, watch. Put this here. Put that there. See? Oh, wait, what the hell is that? And my favorite part that always gets me bitching up a storm. That went off like a clockwork, caramantically speaking. I'm due for an anvil to fall on my head. You better not. Well, Stefan, this is excellent work. Thank you. I'm glad you noticed. The flowers threw me off. They were signed TB, but of course, even Tar calls Dr. Belmont Teddy. Like a common, familiar form of Edward. How could anyone be so calculated? I mean, this affair must have been going on for some time for Sarah to feel so strongly about it. And Tara and Dr. Belma have only been married one year, for one year. They will like, very likely fall short of the mark, but we can't worry about that right now. Sarah isn't out of the woods. If we confront her, she's sure to clam up. And we have no idea what drugs she took, so we figure out what drugs she get back, back up and running until we, she just tried to tell Tara. You say, like, telling her is a foreign conclusion, isn't it? We have to, uh, to tell her, don't we? What proof do we have? The flowers were only direct link to Edward. Everything else comes from Sarah herself. I need to think about this for now. Keep your mouth shut. Man, that's a lot of words for one few seconds. Huh? Saw blade, lovely. I'm saying lovely because I can't find it already. It's always something that has to be so. Oh, fine. Thank you. Ah, la Paris. The la eh, Sorry, la Paris, Paris, Paris. And 
in, I'm just gonna click anywhere because I don't think I'll get anything to scare me. Although, I'll probably do this too much, and then and when I actually do get into one of those singing majiggies, and I'll get the BAH part. And watch you, you probably fell off your chair. You guys, get up. I didn't mean to scare you. Come on, sweethearts. Come. I'm sorry. I'll kiss your boo boos. Oh, but okay. You're all betters. Now you can be okay now. Now you're probably sitting there saying, Dance so it's that was not funny. I'm like, I'm sorry. I was just, I tried to be honest. I thought, I was trying to explain the factor of the, uh, the, the, Hidden object gains that if you click too much, it goes boo, you know? See, now you're probably looking at me like, well, you could have done a simple boo and I'd be fine. No, you had to go boo. And you scared me off my chair, and I'm sitting on the floor, and I got hurt my ankle, and there's something of the sort. You did something. I'm telling you. How about this? Blend the horse. See that horseshoe? The horse did it, not me. I don't want to next to keep hands. That is fleshy. The sandals and the grapes. The sand. What? Even I was like, what? Si beetle? Si beetle. Si beetle. What the hell is a beetle? The beetle. Where's si beetle? The beetle. The beetle. The beetle. The la grapes. And then there they are. See, I see that. And it's a short thought. And there's a beetle. And there's no Lizzie. Lizard. Yes, a Lizard. 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 Where are you? I said the last time, and you showed up, so if I say it long enough, me will show up. Lizard, lizard, lizard! 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 Where are you? Lizard! Where are you? There you are. Aha! I see you. Oh, and the sandals. Okay, guys. Flip Sarah's apartment and bring back evidence of what she took. We'll deal with the car later. We'll do. And Elizabeth, yes. You might want to fix your hair. It's tousled. Oh, well. Yes, it's a little windy here in the courtyard. Yeah, oh, she was making out with a meal, probably. One hour and seven minutes. Wow, I still didn't get it. Okay, let's test this puppy. Bottle of pills. Oh, there you go. Lemetek. The bottle's half empty. Ooh, which means... She could possibly be... Uh, yeah, we kind of know what's going to happen. She's trying to OD herself. Lemantic is a medication for bipolar disorder. Oh boy. It would explain the psychosis and the rash. It's a of lumps. It is definitely Steven Johnson syndrome. Ooh, that's not good. She's lucky she should be fine as long as we watch her. I'm guessing based on that note, I found that she called her meds it's encapsulated sunshine. Probably because they controlled her block periods. A principal with a per principal with a bipolar disorder probably isn't so desirable for a school point of view. Aww. People don't look at bipolar disorder that great. So she's purposely OD'd on her meds because Edward was either planning on breaking off their affair or he just wasn't planning on leaving Tara. Which brings up the question she got the pills in the first place. Surely she would be too weird to see a psychiatrist the board might find out. Didn't you see this pres prescribing doctor's name on the bottle? No, is it? Edward Belmont. Who the hell is that? I forget. Two weeks later. This hasn't been your month. At least I finally found the perfect anniversary present for t Teddy. Divorce papers. You think you know someone. You think you know their mind works. I tell you, Monica, I never get involved with another doctor. It's a terrible idea. We're all hopeless deranged. That's what I told Stefan, but we went ahead anyway. What? Oh, no way! Are they married? Who would have guessed the reason I worked so hard on him? I was so hard on them was because I was soft on him. I could have told you that six months ago. Anyway, good luck with that. The hardest thing for me to understand is why Edward took the risk of prescribing an antipsychotic to Sarah. He's an immunologist, not a psychiatrist. Correction, was an immunologist. Right, at least now you don't have to see him at work every day. Hi, you two. Elizabeth, how are you doing, Tara? Better. How's the acting chief immunologist at Leighton Sands holding up? A little shaky, but okay. It's tough being a, de a department head. Tell us about it. How's your meal? Stunningly handsome. I'm going to help him 
get accredited in the U.S. maybe someday we'll open our own private practice together. Great! Just what the world needs. Another doctor couple. I need a cigarette. I'll join you. Not in the courtyard! Ha 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 ha! That's a freaking... Oh, yay! You remember another episode? You know what that meant. Alright, guys. Well... Let's exit out here. Well, yet again, we say farewell to another awesome, great game, gameplay, gameplay. Uh, anyways, if you haven't become a family member, please give a huggy to that huggy button and give a to that love button if you love and enjoy what we have, meaning our lovely gameplay, or it could just be the conversation, or just a beautiful view, I don't know, but whatever you love, just love kiss that love button all right guys just to let you know about about people who are sweethearts who have not joined the family yet just to let you know that literally if your profile is not public we will not be able to announce your you know welcome with your name but if you do sometimes it takes about maybe 19 hours before it shows up on my end it depends you know how YouTube is but uh usually anyone who becomes a family member we make sure that um you get your personalized blogger letter which is announced on twitter blogger all my google plus collections well not all of them but most of them and also on twitter and the discussion as well you know on our channel just to let everyone know and uh we welcome it i really personally don't like to say at your you know your number so that's why I said to tell everybody when I welcome someone that you know doesn't come across with your name just yet I let everyone know well we don't have their na name yet but when we do we'll let you know so I just thought I'd let you know because any sweetheart who joins our family you're not a number you are family and we love you and we're supportive and we would love to have you all right guys that's the explanation so if you don't know now verbally and see me say it now you know and if you don't know you would have known through the blogger thing you know okay <laughs> all right i love you guys i miss you guys i'll see you in our next adventure i love you i miss you bye guys i love you see you in our next picture bye guys